My name is Etienne Cavaignac. I'm orthopedic surgeon at the Toulouse University Hospital. My focus is knee surgery and I perform more than 300 total knee replacements a year. It's a central question in our daily practice. We will have to face more and more patients that need a total knee replacement. Forecast suggests that the number of candidates will double with the coming years. And at the same time, we have less and less resources to operate our patients because of the lack of nurses, lack of structure, administrative complexity, it's more and more complicated to have a full access to an operative room. Robotic is a very interesting tool and can be helpful in some situations. Management of reverse kinematic alignment, kinematic alignment or functional alignment could only be performed using PSI or robotic solution. Users of this technique have still to demonstrate the superiority of this technique, particularly concerning the clinical outcome. No doubt that the PIS will succeed in it. Last but not least, from a marketing point of view, it's clear that robotic is a modern solution that can increase the notoriety of the surgeon and particularly the local notoriety. I would say that with the actual knowledge, comparison between robotic surgery and manual surgery show that robotic surgery is more expensive, time consuming, and keep in mind that we have less and less access to the operative room, and the clinical results are almost the same between the two types of surgeries. For me, the choice is clear. I use a manual instrumentation made by three sets. The first step is a tibial cut 90 degrees to the mechanical axis. I use tensor ligamentus to make a kind of personalized knee procedure. My cutting block is a five in one, which is very efficient. I use cementless implant and in all the cases, the patella is also fast. I believe today it is simple, personalized, time efficient, cost efficient. So it helped me to treat more and more patients with a valid option. PCO is not my community, it's your community. So please share case reports, ideas or whatever you want on practicalcourseorthopedics.com.